going to show you how to fix any of the iPhone 13s where it's stuck in a boot loop where it constantly keeps restarting. Like you'll see uh, the Apple logo, then it'll turn off, and the Apple logo appear again, and it'll turn off. Basically, it's stuck in a constant uh, rebooting state. Okay, now take note that this one is fixed, but I'm going to give you several solutions to fix a boot loop issue. And this is only going to help for about 70% of you guys. Okay, if, if you tried all the steps in this video, then it's possible that you know you need like a screen replacement or you just need to go ahead and bring it to a repair shop, all right? But like I said, by the end of this video, at least 70% of you guys should be up and running, okay? So let's go ahead and pretend that I'm stuck in a boot loop here now. Okay, it keeps turning off. I keep seeing Apple logo, and then it keeps turning off. So let's pretend I'm stuck in a boot loop here. First thing we want to do is go ahead and uh, restart your iPhone 13 using a special key combination. The key combination is going to be you tap volume up, volume down, press and hold that power button, and do not let go until you see the Apple logo appear, then let go and hopefully it boots up properly, okay? So we're going to do this together. Pretend I'm stuck in a boot loop here and we'll do it together. Ready? Go. Volume up, volume down, press and hold that power button and do not let go. So keep holding on to the power button. Just wait. Just do not let go until we see the Apple logo, okay? So now what's going to happen here is going to go and turn off the phone and now starting back up. I'm still holding on to the power button. Now when you see the Apple logo again right now, go ahead and let go and hopefully it boots up properly okay so give it one second just be patient here and it should boot up properly like this okay now if that didn't work then we're going to go to the second step okay so the next step we want to do is go ahead and grab your phone you can see the power button right here what I want you to do is spam the power button in and out okay so just press in and out pretend I'm stuck in a boot loop still just with the power button here press in and out quickly it's possible that you're power button could be stuck, jammed, could have lint in there, dust, maybe water or uh, coffee or soda got in there. Just keep spamming it just like that. Now, also if you have a case on, take the case off right now, okay? Now go ahead and plug in, plug in your charging cable. You want to give it a little bit of juice and just let it sit there for a little bit. And again, let's pretend I'm still stuck in a boot loop, okay? Now while it's plugged in and it's charging, we're going to do the same thing now. We're going to restart it. Remember, ready, go. Volume up, volume down. Press and hold that power button and do not let go until we see the um, Apple logo appear. Okay, so it's, it's plugged in. It's charging. Just wait. I'm still holding on to the power button. Okay, now the phone is off. I'm still holding on to the power button. Now when the Apple logo appears, go ahead and let go. And hopefully um, you are out of the black screen now. If you still are, then we're going to go to the third possible step. Okay, so third step, we can go ahead and unplug the phone. Again, let's pretend I'm still stuck in a boot loop. What we're gonna do now is what I call the tap method. What we're gonna do is tap. Hold the phone like this and tap. Two fingers all over the screen and all over the back. And this basically, you know, it's possible that you got something slightly dislodged somewhere and a, and a simple tap can pop it back in place and all of a sudden your screen will just turn on magically. So let's grab the phone like this. Let's pretend I'm stuck in the loop. And then go ahead and give two fingers and tap kind of hard, okay? You want to do it all over. And sometimes as you're doing this, you may be stuck in a boot loop, but all of a sudden, all of a sudden the screen just pops on right here. Okay, anyway, just keep on tapping, all right? Turn it over. You got to do it on the back side, all over, okay? Even all around the camera lens, just do it, okay? Also, I'm not responsible if anything happens to your phone, okay? FYI. So just keep tapping like that. Turn it over. You're still stuck in a boot loop, no problem. From here, we're going to go ahead and restart it with a special key combination again, okay? So from here, again, remember, volume up, volume down, press and hold that power button, and do not let go until we see an Apple logo appear. Then go ahead and let go, and hopefully you are up and running now. If not, we're going to go to the fourth possible method. So the next possible method we're going to do here is what I call the massage method. What I want you to do is go ahead and grab your phone with two hands like this and grab both of your thumbs, and what you can do is press in all over on the screen and all over in the back. There's the same premise as uh, tapping as well, okay? So you can go ahead and get like a cloth. You don't want to smudge up your screen. It really doesn't matter. But we can start off on the screen right here and pretend I'm stuck in a boot loop. And then what you what I want to do is just press in, press in, press in. Sometimes you hear a little click and all of a sudden um, it's going to boot up properly, okay? But anyway, just keep on pressing, keep on pressing. Press, press, press. Same thing as on the back of the phone, okay? Press, press, you can see press. Just give it like a good, nice massage 
all over all over around here as well just press press turn it over and see if you're out of the boot loop see if your um, screen popped on normally if you're still stuck in the boot loop and again we're going to go ahead and restart it using the special key combination remember ready go volume up volume down press and hold that power button and do not let go until we see the apple logo appear okay and then you can go ahead and let go now if you're still down the next method i have for you is what i call the smack method so what we're going to do is just go ahead and hold your palm out like this. Actually, I mean, if you don't want to smudge it up, you can use a rag, but it really doesn't matter. Just hold out your palm like this, and we can start off on the screen. What I want to do is smack it just like this. Give it a bunch of wax. Also, you want to get on the bottom of the screen as well, okay? So give it a couple of wax down here. You know, look at your phone. Sometimes when you do that, you know, after the wax, sometimes all of a sudden, boom, you know, you're on the uh, login screen, okay? And the same thing with the back of here, okay? We want to do the back of the phone. Also on the bottom back, okay? Give it, give it a bunch of wax, turn it over. You're still stuck in a boot loop, no problem. We're going to go ahead and restart it again. Remember, volume up, volume down, press and hold that power button, and do not let go until you see the Apple logo appear. Now, hopefully you're up, up and running. If not, we're going to go to the next step. All right, so for the next step here, what I want you to do is this. As your phone is stuck in the boot loop, what I want you to do is put it into your freezer, the coldest part of your refrigerator. Put, leave it naked just like this, put it in your freezer, leave it there for 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, grab your cold phone out of the freezer and restart, restart again using a special key combination. Remember, volume up, volume down, press and hold that power button, and do not let go until you see the Apple logo appear, then go ahead and let go. Now, after all these steps, hopefully you are up and running now. Now, if you're not, what I want you to do is start from the very beginning of the video and try every single step. Also, if you have a screen protector on here, you may want to go ahead and pry that off, okay? Also, of course, make sure you don't have a case on there. So you can start off from the very beginning video and try every step and go all the way down. And then if you get down to the freezer method again, instead of leaving it in there 15 minutes, leave it in there for 30 minutes, okay? And the second time around, it doesn't work. Try every step again, three times, four times. Try it up to seven times. Believe it or not, sometimes the seventh, the seventh try um, is a charm, okay? So anyway, if this worked for you, uh, give me a like and comment which step worked for you. And if it didn't work for you, uh, give me a thumbs down. We should definitely see more uh, thumbs up and thumbs down on this video, okay? Anyway, uh, good luck, guys.